Hi everyone, uh, my name is Cheyenne and I'm here to introduce Nutty One by Nature's Instabrow product. So I actually found out about this product after getting my nails done and immediately fell in love with the idea. So I'm gonna show you how to try that out today. First of all, the brows come on a sheet like this and you are going to want to cut out as close to the eyebrow shape as you can, which is going to end up looking a little bit like this. And you'll see that on one side, it has like a shiny um, film. On the other side, it's just paper. So you're gonna wanna make sure that you put the side that has the shiny part onto your actual eyebrow. Anyway, let's get to it. So you're gonna peel that um, like sticker part off on the back, just like this. And you can see a little shine on there. That's the part you're, that you're gonna wanna put onto your actual eyebrow. But before we do that, we can go ahead and map out the eyebrow. And you can do this several different ways. It depends on how your nose is shaped, but there is a little diagram on the back of each of these if you need to sort of look at that. But first, you're gonna start right about here at your eyebrow. And you can use a skewer, a string, um, anything, uh, even like a, like a makeup brush to do this but you're just wanna, you just kinda wanna start at the outside of your nostril to get the beginning of the brow. And you can kinda mark that with a makeup brush. Okay. Hopefully you guys can see that little dot. We're gonna do the same to the other side. So this is roughly where your eyebrows are going to start. So now you wanna go ahead and get the arch of your eyebrow and you're going to kind of put it in the, in the middle of the tip and I guess the edge of your nostril. And just, I like to put it through the point in my lip on either side. And just mark where that is. And now for the last marking that you have to do. So you just literally go to the edge of your nostril right here, up to the edge of your eye. Make a mark. My advice to you guys, um, I your brow should always be lower at the um, front of your brow than at the end of your brow. So it should always be going up just a little bit. So now it's time to actually put the brow onto your face, which is the exciting part. So you're gonna take the brow, like I said, you wanna make sure that the shiny part is the part that goes onto your skin. And what I really like about these is they have a stamp on the other side so you can see exactly where the eyebrow is going to be whenever you place one on your face, which is really helpful. And um, another great thing about this product. So another thing that might be helpful for your, for your guys is um, taking this and kind of just making it an indent on your, uh, in the middle, that kind of looks weird, but just to make sure your eyebrows are even and straight Just kind of make that mark there. Put it on your eyebrow. Line it up with the dots. And then you're going to take a uh, damp paper towel 
And you were just going to put that on for two to three seconds. And you never want to peel off from the edge. You just want to go ahead and slide up. And there you have your brow. And if you have any lifting, you can just go back with some water and kind of just push that down a little bit at the edges. Awesome, so you have one brow on, and any markings that are still kind of there, you can just wipe off with a Q-tip or some makeup. And I'm just gonna go ahead and do the other brow really quick. And again, you're just gonna slide that brow up. And if you do have hair, there could be a little lifting, but like I was saying before, just take some water on those edges, pat them down. Because I personally shave off the ends of my eyebrows, but I know some people have some patches or bald spots in their brows, so you just kind of have to work around the hair. All right. All right, so we have our eyebrows on. Now it is time to set them. Okay, so you're going to take some baby powder or if you have like a setting powder of any sort, that'll work just fine. And I'm actually gonna use Airspun today, very popular setting uh, powder. You can get it five bucks at Walmart, very easy to find. So you're just going to take your finger or you can do a brush if you want and then just kinda Go over that lightly. And this is basically to eliminate the shine from the brow because it is um, a temporary tattoo and there can be a little bit of sheen coming off from it. So this is just to make it more look more natural and yeah, more like an eyebrow. And I'm actually gonna go in on these ends a little bit more with some water real quick. So we're gonna use hairspray to um, set it after you do the powder just to really lock that in. Make sure you shut your eyes because you don't want to get this in your eyes. The last step we are going to do is use the Secure the Blur Makeup Magnet Primer. And we are just going to put a little bit of that right on top of the brow. This is to matte it and make it even more um, natural. Another thing that you can do, you can always go in with like a dip brow or an eyeshadow, put a couple more hairs here and there, and you're good to go. But this is the Insta Brow by Nutty One by Nature. You can scan this through the camera. Go ahead and scan that. That's gonna take you right to everything you need. And please like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I really hope that you get to try this product out.